First to developing news in North Austin, a student fires a gun on a local high school campus. The school officials say a 16-year-old shot and killed himself in the middle of the school day. We don't normally report on these types of incidents, but it happened in the middle of the school day in the main courtyard of Lanier High School. This is a satellite image of the campus. The incident raises a lot of concerns about how a gun was brought into the school and whether other students could have been put at risk. KXAN's education reporter Aaron Cargyle is outside the school with the very latest. Aaron. Good evening, Leslie. Austin ISD officials are only giving us very basic information right now about what some students witnessed here today. Behind me, you can see campus police are still on the scene out here. They tell us kids were around when the gun went off at 12.04 this afternoon, which is lunchtime. This campus went on lockdown, and a short time later, the district sent an automated phone message from the superintendent to parents telling them a student shot and killed himself at school and that the lockdown had been lifted and kids could go home early. Now, we were here when concerned parents started arriving to pick up their kids. KXAN's Kevin Schwaller has more on what was running through their minds. Parents lined up to make sure their children were safe. Some knew what happened here at Lanier High School. Yeah, downtown too. Linda Joseph, however, left for the school with only this. Well, uh, my granddaughter called me and told me that there was a sh shooting at the school. So I couldn't believe it. I was in bed, so I jumped right out of bed and came right over here to see what the problem was. And when she got here, police and EMS were parked around the school. Students had been let go for the day. Her granddaughter was okay physically. Still, the initial word of a gun and a shot at the school worried Joseph. First, I teared up a little bit because I thought something might have happened to her, and she didn't really want to let me know. Joseph says there was a calm in the chaos. Parents weren't yelling. Students were going home. It's now about dismissal time, and the parents that were out here on the sidewalk earlier are now gone. They've taken their children home, and the staff that would normally be saying goodbye to the students for the day are inside the building in a staff meeting discussing how to talk to students about what happened when they come back to school. And home is where Joseph will be trying to talk with her granddaughter about what happened and how to cope. And to pray most of all. And God bless her every day when she comes to school and when she leaves so that she gets back safely. At Lanier High School, Kevin Schwaller, KXAN News. Now, counselors who are part of a special crisis team will be here on campus until 6 o'clock tonight to help any students and teachers who need it. Tomorrow morning, it's a normal start time for students, but there are still many unanswered questions, including just how a student got a gun on campus and were there any warning signs? Live in North Austin tonight, Aaron Cargyle, KXAN News. And for more information on how AISD is handling this case and crisis numbers, you can head to our website, kxan.com.